also, whenever, as we said from this, whenever Allah prohibits something, it means absolute prohibition unless stated otherwise. We should avoid such a thing absolutely. If Allah says in the Quran or the Prophet ﷺ also says that we should avoid a thing completely, that is evidence that it is haram. Just because he didn't say it's haram, but he said, don't come near it. That is even stronger than just saying it's haram. Right? As in the case of alcohol, gambling, and fortune telling, where Allah in Surah Al-Ma'idah said, indeed gambling, alcohol, gambling, fortune telling are filth from the work of Satan, so avoid them totally in order to be successful. I should mention here as a point, that the term filth, rijs, another term for it in Arabic is najas or najasa. Some scholars took from this that alcohol is najasa. That if najasa gets on you, your wudu is broken. You cannot pray with najasa on you. So they ruled that the use of cologne with alcohol in it was prohibited because it is najasa. However, this alcohol, mention of alcohol here, is mentioned along with gambling and fortune telling. Is gambling impurity? Physical? Meaning when you play with your poker cards, your wudu is broken? No, it's not. Nobody says this. Or you, you use a fortune telling device, your wudu is broken? No. So, what was understood from this, more correctly, is that the filth that is mentioned here is spiritual filth. That it defiles one's iman. This is where the danger lies. So, the use of alcohol in this regard is, is permissible in colognes, etc. And again, what we have to keep in mind is that uh, cologne and the alcohol in cologne is it drinking alcohol. People who drink cologne, what happens to them? They go blind, you know. So simply because it is chemically referred to as alcohol, we clarified before that what is intended here when we talk about the prohibition of alcohol is the drinking alcohol the one from which you become intoxicated. Otherwise, as we mentioned earlier, you can't even use antifreeze because antifreeze is also alcohol.